So there are four major body fluids that you can become infected through. Blood, vaginal secretions, semen, and breast milk. With semen, it can also be an ejaculatory, so that's really important to know in, in the, the pre-cum. The, the, so with blood, you have to look at, for example, tattoos, and be really careful if you're going to get um, a tattoo. Are they sterilized? Do they use new needles uh, to make the to make the um, the tattoo on your on your body? So sterile conditions are really important. Um, there are ways to protect yourself. Of course, for sex, there's condoms. It's the main area, and there are latex condoms. You want to use latex, um, not lambskin, for example, which is porous and it'll come through and then you have the risk of being infected. In sex, is, um, it's active and there can be small cuts and tears that you don't know about, so it's really important to protect yourself. And not only protect yourself from HIV, but from other STDs, other sexually transmitted diseases, such as chlamydia, which is really uh, rising out in the world right now, according to the Department of Health, also um, syphilis, any of the major uh, STDs. So using protection is really important, and you can have sex with HIV, but you have to use precautions. And um, I, I want to say that it's really important to disclose to your partner that you have HIV before you're going to have sexual relations at that, at that type of intimate level because in certain states it can be criminalized and if you don't and the person gets infected, uh, you can go to jail.